Good morning, everybody. My name is Carol Butler, and I own Duckling Stay Nursery in Hoylake, Morton on the Wirral, and West Derby in Liverpool. I'm saying this now because the videos are getting shared all over the place, <coughs> which I never expected. So, good morning, Duckling Stay Nursery children. I've I'm going to introduce my little dog, Lily. She had an operation yesterday on her poorly knees and she wants to come and join in with all of you lot. She wants to be part of our little gang. So she's got a little, some little stitches here in her, in her knee and we just look after it and keep her safe. So is it okay if she joins in with us today? Is that okay, everybody? I knew you'd say yes. So today's story is one of our favourites, Stickman. And Julia, Don Julia Donaldson wrote this story. How clever. Should we start? There he is. Stickman. Stickman lives in the family tree with his stick lady Liv and their stick children three. One, two, three. One day he wakes early and goes for a jog. Stickman, oh stickman, beware of the dog. He's running. Oh no, oh no. <gasps> a stick box, a dog. Woof. An excellent stick. The right kind of stick for my favourite trick running away with a stick in its mouth. I'll fetch it and drop it. I'll fit, fetch it and then I'll drop it and fetch it and drop it again. I'm not a stick. Why can't you see? I'm Stickman. I'm Stickman. I'm Stickman. That's me. I want to go home to the family tree. There he is in the air. Oh no. And notice says, dogs must be kept on the lead. At last the game's over and Stickman is freed. He sets off home with a hop and a twirl. Stickman, oh Stickman, beware of the girl. A stick cries a girl with a smile on her face. That's right. That's right. All right hold on a minute. The right kind of poo stick for winning the race. <gasps> Has everyone got one? Get ready to throw it. One, two, three. Into the river they go. Down it goes. There's the sheep looking at him. He tosses and turns till the frolicking till the frolicking foam washes him up on the beach far from home. There's all the sunbathers. Or which country I wonder which country he's in. He come here comes a dad with a spade in his hand. Stickman, oh stickman, beware of the sand. A mast yells the dad, an excellent mast. Hooray, there's a flag on our castle at last. You see the mast? I'm not a mast for a silly old flag or a sword for a knight. 
or a hook for a bag. I'm not a pen. I'm not a bow. I'm not a bat or a boomerang. No, I'm... Who is he? Who is he, Eva? Who could he be, Philip? Stickman, oh, Stickman, beware of the snow. Have I missed a page? Oh, no, it hasn't. Sorry. Stickman, oh, Stickman, beware of the snow. Here comes a boy in a warm woolly scarf, an arm for the snowman, he says, will be a laugh. There. Just going to put the stick inside the snowman for an arm. I'm not an arm, can nobody see? I'm Stickman, I'm Stickman, I'm Stickman, not me! Will I ever get back to the family? Free! Look at the arm. Oh dear. Stickman is lonely. Stickman is lost. Stickman is frozen and covered in frost. Stickman is weary. His eyes start to close. He's stretching the yawns and lies down and lies down for a dose. There he is. He can't hear the bells or the sweet singing choir. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Or the voices saying, here's a good stick for the fire. <gasps> oh no! Stickman is lying asleep in the grate. Oh my goodness, no. No, no, no. Can anybody wake him before it's too late? Can they, can they, can they? No, 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 no. He dreams of his kids and his stick lady love. Then suddenly wakes. What's that noise up above? He's, it starts as a chuckle, then turns to a shout. Ho, 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 I'm stuck, get me out! A stuckman, a stuckman! No one could, now who could that be? Don't worry, cries stickman, I'll soon set you free! There he is, he's pulling the boot down. A scratch and a scream, a flurry of soot, a wiggle and jiggle and... Ow, pokes our foot. A shove and a nudge, a hop and a jump. And Santa falls into the room with a thump. Stickman, oh Stickman, you excellent friend. Thanks, thanks a million, thanks without end. The stickman helps Santa deliver the toys to fast asleep girls and to fast asleep boys. Faster and faster they fly through the snow till Santa says, only one chimney to go. Thank goodness for that. <gasps> Look, stick ladies lonely. The children are sad. It won't feel like Christmas without their stick dad. They toss and they turn in the family bed. But what is that clatter sound overhead? <gasps> Someone is tumbling into their house. Is it a bird or a bat or a mouse? <gasps> or could it be, yes, it just possibly be. Oh yes, hold on. Or could it, or could it, yes, could it just possibly be? I'm Stigman, I'm Stigman, I'm Stigman, that's me. I'm sticking right here in the family tree. Yay! That was a nice story. And we're really still here enjoying it. Before I go now and I say goodbye till this afternoon when I post another activity, go into the garden. Go and look at the sticks and the branches and the trees and look what's happening. You might see things growing on them. I want you to use good words to describe things use a good rich vocabulary look at the how does the stick feel how, has it got bark on it is it bumpy is it smooth is it lumpy use some good descriptive words to tell me what is happening in your garden do we have long sticks short sticks now i know this is part of a branch it's not really a stick could be couldn't be but it's a branch is it fat? Is it thin? Which
which one's the tallest, which one's the shortest, which one's the longest, etc, etc. But what I want you to do is use a good, rich vocabulary to describe what's happening in your garden. I'll see you all later. I hope that was okay. Bye!